due horrible stormy rubbishy weather today but we've woken up and it's absolutely gloriously sunshiny boiling so we're just heading down oh my goodness be quiet oh wait okay i'm going to continue because the roads are just busy and noisy this morning we're heading down to the beach for a little bit and then i just look at the weather and it does say that we're due possible storms in around an hour or so so we're going to get to the beach and make the most of it whilst we can and then we're going to walk along and I think we'll walk to the river. I'm not sure yet. The waves are big today. I don't think we're going in though. No. You're not going in. Back at the hotel, I'm just gonna get a little bit of editing done. I'm a little bit behind because of our like massive full day out at um, what's it called? Bin Pearl, yes, yeah, Bin Pearl. I didn't get any work done that day, obviously, because we were like out the whole day. Um, so I'm a little bit behind, and also the internet in this place is really slow, which is my vlogs have been a little bit late uploading recently, the last couple of days, because. I started an upload this morning at about 7 o'clock. It's 20 past 12 at the moment. I started an upload at 7 o'clock. It's now 14%. So, yeah, it's quite slow. Um, but I'm going to do it at work. This one is going to write a Christmas list. He's just online now. Yeah. Have a little look at some things he wants for Christmas. And going to write a Christmas birthday. list because and birthday. Yes, it's Stephen's birthday on the 28th of December, which is a nightmare. But no, it's not. It, it isn't. Well, no. Actually, it is a bit well, of a nightmare I because. I don't like it. No. Because I'm like, I've got to wait until the yeah, to get stuff. But it's quite it is quite useful because like if you want something in June and sometimes you get it. Like, it's quite good. Whereas like my birthday is in June. So if I want something then I have to wait for my birthday in June, whereas you just tend to get things in the summer. Yeah. So it is a bit of a nightmare in our family because we've got my my mum's mum, my nan, her birthday is on the twentieth in fact, no, Stephen's cousin's birthday is on the fourteenth of um December, then it's my nan's birthday on the twenty third then it's Stephen's birthday on the 28th. It's my mum's birthday on the 29th. Is that it? Yeah, that's it. Too many birthdays around Christmas. We haven't even, we haven't really like thought about Christmas. Obviously, like being out here, it doesn't kind of feel the same. We haven't got, I haven't like got excited about it or anything whatsoever. Like normally by, I'm not gonna say normally by now, I would have like done some shopping or whatever. That's a complete lie. I am completely unorganised with Christmas. I say every year that I'm going to try and be organised with buying presents and stuff. I never am. It's always quite last minute. But it's like 60. I wonder how many days it is till Christmas. I don't know. I'm going to have to work that out. Let me know if you know how many days it is until Christmas. I'm going to work it out. You're going to work it out. Stephen's going to work out how many days it is till Christmas. Excited. It doesn't feel like it because, of, you know, obviously we're out here like, on the beach and it's warm and everything. Obviously at home, everyone's saying, you know, it's freezing cold and we should be wrapped up in jumpers and everything by now. But we're not. We're lying on beaches, which I'm certainly not complaining about, by the way. How many? 30. 39 days till Christmas. Wait, no. You got it wrong. I'm sure there must be an app or something that you can have on your phone that tells you how many days it is till Christmas. Yeah, there is. Yeah. Look! Our first Christmas tree! I shouldn't be, yeah, I mean, we spotted it, it just outside our hotel. Happy New Year, Happy New Year and a Christmas tree. <laughs> well, the storm and the horrible weather never really happened, to be honest. It's gonna yeah, it's going to happen now. Now we've come out. We've been in the hotel for a little while. We're heading out. We've left it too late because I got really backed up in work and stuff. Um, 
We've left it probably too late to walk over to the river, which was the plan of what we were going to do. So, no thank you. Um, I don't really know what we're doing. We're just kind of heading out and... I don't know. We've, uh, see what happens. The crazy roads of Vietnam. Are you ready? Yep. To try and cross? Right. Um, maybe let's go now. Yep. Sides. And after this taxi, and you know, after this bike. Yay, we made it! <laughs> we are wandering away from the beach and from kind of the main touristy bit. Oh my goodness, why do they drive on the pavement? Why do they do that? <laughs> anyway. Um, yeah, wandering away. No, sure. Yeah, we might have wandered over. Wouldn't put it past them. We're wandering away from the main tourist a bit and just kind of exploring around and a little bit of Pokemon in and just walking. That's what I like best about when you're in a new place. So noisy. When you're in a new place, I think the best thing to do is just go for a wander. I really do enjoy just wandering around, not really knowing where you're going and just discovering and exploring new places. Nicest person in Vietnam. Yeah. <laughs> Nicest person in Vietnam. I love it. We have stumbled across this Ave Maria by the church thing, and now we're going to have a little explore. Done yet? Hang on. Oh my goodness, it's madness. <laughs> on this evidence, I am so so glad I didn't have a bike in the trunk. I'm glad you got I didn't. Yep. No way could I drive in this. Oops, look where we ended up. Look what we've got. We got a pizza hut. Mm. I am um, a battery's about to die. That's a shame. We have had our two, we are on our way wandering back to near the hotel. It's only, we thought, we thought it was about Maybe nine o'clock nice. or something. Yeah, we both thought it was about nine o'clock, just took it down. It's only half past six. It feels so, so much later than that. It's I am flat. so, so ready for bed. I thought like, oh, we'll just have our tea and then go home, get into bed, fall asleep. But it's so early. I think I'm still gonna probably do that though, to be honest. Oh no, we've got a long way home at like a 20 minute walk and it's just started to rain. That's not good. Hopefully it doesn't lash down. I don't think it's going to, I think it might just be a little bit of a spit. Which is quite nice. It kind of cools you off because it's very warm. We are about a minute from home now and it has rained on us all the way. A little bit more than a spit, but not a massive big downpour. It's not been too bad, has it? No. No, we're nearly home. We're gonna get home and I don't know what we're gonna do. That's it for the day. We're not coming back out, are we? No. No, that's it for the evening, I think. Get back home and do a bit of work, watch a bit of something or other, I think. 